let's go through some examples of how to add and subtract matrices on the GraphLock web app. So first, let's go to our calculator, and I'm going to choose the matrix calculator. Now, first step, we need to enter in our matrices and actually store them in order to evaluate. So I'm first going to select M1 and choose the size. This one will be a 2 by 2 matrix. Let's select where we want to start entering in our values. Make sure you enter them in correctly, and now we must store it. So select Functions and click Store, and it'll tell you matrix M1 is now stored. So now let's enter in matrix 2. So I'm going to select M2 and once again choose the size. This will be another 2 by 2. Select where you want to start adding. Make sure you entered it in correctly, and once again, we now need to store this matrix. So I'm going to select Functions and Store. So now matrix 2 is now stored as well. Once you have your matrices stored that you would like to use, remember, in order to actually use them, you must click Eval and make sure it's highlighted in order to bring those stored matrices back out. So if I want to add them together, I simply click M1 plus M2, and there is our answer. Now if I want to subtract them, let's say M1 minus M2, now we get our answer again. Say, for example, we want to try to add two different ones. I'm going to unselect the eval button, and that will allow me to edit my matrices. So if I click here at M1, we can see that's what we have stored. But I actually want to change our M2 function, and I want to change it to a 2 by 3 matrix. So once again, let's select and enter in our values. Make sure you entered it correctly, and we have to store. So functions store. So M2 is now stored. So now, once again, let's add our M1 and M2 together. Remember, in order to do that, you must click eval first. So I'm going to go M1 plus M2 equals, and notice I get a dimension mismatch. So we get an error. It's telling us that our dimensions do not match, so you cannot add these together. So that's how you add and subtract matrices on the GraphLock web app.